else? Here's what we know right now. A little mm -hmm. background here. Three weeks ago, Northwest Academy, boarding school in Nye County for at-risk kids, under investigation for child abuse. A teacher was arrested at the beginning of the month for slamming a student to the ground. That started an investigation, and tonight we can report this. Northwest Academy is owned by a Marcel and Patty Chapuy. Marcel and Chatty, Patty Chapuy have both been arrested. Let's show you the charges. Marcel, Marcel Chapuy, the psychologist and co-owner, now in custody, facing 43 counts of child abuse. Bail set at $100,000 for him. Patricia Chapuy, facing 45 counts of child abuse and neglect. We are learning she is not in custody today. Both of them do in court at 9 a.m. The significance here, obviously, is this is a school where kids are looking to find help. They say they're getting anything but. We've talked to former students who uh, tell us that teachers' abuse is rampant there by teachers and former staff members. We're reaching out to the state right now to find out what happens next. But our team coverage continues with News 3's Faith Jesse. Faith has been on this all morning. All right, Faith, with more on the nuts and bolts of what exactly led up to all of this. Yeah, new details about two more arrests in this Northwest Academy child abuse case. One was a man, one was a woman arrested here in Las Vegas. We cannot confirm if they were the owners, but that is what Nye County is telling us. And they were arrested for felony child abuse, neglect, and endangerment. Nye County Sheriff's launched an investigation into claims of child abuse at the boarding school for at-risk teens last month. It's located in Armagosa Valley, about 100 miles <clears throat> northwest of Las Vegas. But police say the latest arrest took place in Painted Desert, a residential community near West Ann Road and North Durango Drive. While police have not yet released the identities of the suspects, their arrest comes after a third suspect, 29-year-old Caleb Hill, was taken into custody after allegations that he slammed a student onto the ground several times. An update from Nye County. We're waiting on that. When they do update us with more information, we'll be able to bring it.